What is up, spooky people? Welcome back to our channel. Uh, my name is Leo. My name is Andy, and we're back at it again with Nukes Top 5. But for some reason, it's the top 10 ghost videos that scream at you from your nightmares. It just gets worse, man. Are you excited? No, absolutely not. <sighs> Scare right into it, Chief. Oh my god, bro. Take a deep breath. Just a... It won't matter. It won't matter. Alright. Top 10 ghosts caught on camera. Project Paranormal. Paranormal investigator Dave Jones from the YouTube channel Project Paranormal sent me an email about a video he received from a friend. Dave's friend says that he's been experiencing disturbing paranormal activity in his historic home in Michigan, a house that was once used as a funeral home. Oh, the man yeah. says that at all hours of the day and night, he hears the sounds of conversations, footsteps, <laughs> and even the front door opening and closing on its own. In an attempt to capture some kind of evidence of the strange events, <laughs> he sets up a camera in his living room and leaves to go to work. When he comes home and checks his footage, he is shocked by what he finds. No. Why? A creepy shadow-like figure can be seen walking through the living room and behind the couch. Dave and his friend believe the apparition to be a visible manifestation of the spirit that haunts the home. Whatever it is, it doesn't appear to be a normal shadow, because as you can see, it clearly passes behind the couch. But what do you think? Let me know down in the comments. You can watch this video over on Dave's YouTube channel, Project. Chief, e even even like the, the, the wallpaper creeps me out. Like, it, it looks creepy, bro. Jeez, why do you have it that way? <laughs> Comments. You can watch this video over on Dave's YouTube channel, Project Paranormal. Hey, get out of here, man. Marissa Whitehead and her boyfriend are spending the night at the Cumberland Inn in Saskatchewan, Canada. When suddenly, out of the corner of her eye, Marissa spots something odd moving in the bathroom. She takes out her phone and starts to record. Oh, no, hell no. No. Oh, no. hell no. 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 Marissa says they no, sir. Why are you rewinding? Did you hear my guy? Did you hear my guy? Hey, guy, you Marissa says they checked the ceiling, but nobody was up there. And besides that, this flimsy drop ceiling would be too weak to support the weight of even the smallest person. I mean, to be fair, cause you know, I like to kinda, you know, use my brain a bit, and you know, I try to think rationally. Um, it could be a draft or something that's lifting the panel up every time she opens the door or something. It's possible, it's possible. Can't, you know, we gotta really break it down. I love my boy though. My boy said, "Get out of here, man." You think? But never mind. Never huh? mind. Never mind. You think he was on? Uh... Oh, no. you what's do up have with to you admire the ghost vanquishing technique of Marissa's boyfriend. Ah! Holy f hey, you, man. Yeah, he was Before definitely on that. The next video, if you see anything that you think should be included in the top five, contact us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Passing through. W. Wahid posted a video of his nephew playing in his new light up rabbit hat at their home in Indonesia. But he caught something else that he wasn't expecting. Something downright chilling. Oh, hell no! A strange misshapen dark figure <laughs> seems to run by in the background. What the now, shit? some commenters suggested that it could simply be another small child running past the door. But that just doesn't look like a child to it me. Don't, bro. And the kid would also have to be running along at about the speed of an Olympic sprinter. <laughs> so did Wahid capture an odd shadow creature in their home? What is that, or is it bro? all just an elaborate hoax? 
you decide. I don't know about <laughs> that. I love, I love how I jumped. <laughs> no, I jumped. I, I jumped. Too. <laughs> he ran by me. This man, I jumped. This man was it, Usain Bolt through that door, bro. It, it kind of looks like the thing in that one video that was walking with the, the with the goat or whatever it was. What was it? A dog? I don't know, I don't know, know what, what they do in the shadows. Popular <laughs> Chinese ghost hunter Xiao Long is back with another exploration of an extremely haunted location in China. A house that has been abandoned for over 20 years. Yeah, this mysterious house is very different before. from the other local buildings around it, as it looks like something right out of a medieval fairy tale. All that is known about the large estate is that the last owner was a very wealthy man whose life was taken under very strange and tragic circumstances. The house never sold, as many bizarre rumors begin to circulate that the home was cursed. Locals begin to refer to the estate as, quote, the haunted house. So Xiao Long sets out to investigate whether the building is truly haunted or if it's all just local legend that started up because of the house's odd appearance. As always, Xiao Long broadcasts his exploration live to his Chinese livestream audience. <laughs> Xiao Long heads inside and immediately discovers that the odd interior of the house matches the extravagant outside, and the ghost hunter gets a little creeped out by the decor. Now Xiao Long begins to ask some questions directed at any spirits that might inhabit the house, but not in Chinese. Who are you? I'm here. <laughs> yeah, I'm a vampire. Oh my God. Oh my God. What are you doing? What am I doing? I'm so scared. I'm like that ghost feeling. 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 Like that 我操你妈！鸡皮疙瘩出来了！我操你妈！阿明，你看到这窗户没？ 虫子哪能干他妈这么大呀！再说是风的情况下，那那后边那叶子也不动呢。看后边那草，操你妈！ After Xiao Long asks a few questions in English, a window begins to oddly shake and vibrate on its own. The ghost hunter points out that the leaves behind the window don't move, eliminating the possibility that it might have been wind or a draft. Then Xiao Long hears something coming from downstairs, Hell and no. things take a terrifying turn. It sounds exciting. Hello? 
Two folding trestles move on their own. They almost appear to be walking. Hell no. And so, Shalong runs over and kicks the shit out of them. As you do when trestles start walking about. <laughs> anyway, Shalong runs outside and takes a break to gather his courage. He then returns and continues to explore. Bro, I'm sweating, floor, he looks bro. through a window and sees a car parked outside nearby. Shalong becomes concerned that the locals might have alerted someone about the ghost hunter's secret visit to the house. He doesn't know it yet, but that is about to be the least of his worries. Because what happens next is downright chilling. figure can be seen standing at the window in the next room. He quickly runs over, but there's no one there. Shocked by what he's just witnessed, he once again runs outside. But he isn't done just yet. He finds that whoever had parked their car and was snooping around has left. So he heads back inside to investigate once again. And it did not go well. <laughs> What the hell am I looking at you? I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking anxiety, bro. As Xiaolong looks into a mirror, he sees someone or something standing behind him. But when he turns around, no one there. Whoever or whatever he saw standing behind him in the mirror has disappeared in a split second. So just what did Xiaolong capture live on camera? Are the local stories true? Is the mysterious home really haunted? Let me know what you think. You can find this video and many more of Xiaolong's explorations with English subtitles over on his YouTube channel, Outdoor Xiaolong. <gasps> I had to start checking my heart rate on these videos. I know, my watch is telling me to breathe. That's where uh -oh. we had, Andy. Hold on, hold on. Let me get a quick breather, though. 109. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> Why is it 109, bro? Like I'm working out or something? Like nice. what the hell? TikTok user Kaylin Moore from Los Angeles, California claims that an old mirror in her home sometimes <sighs> shows things that just aren't there. So this is an old mirror that I upcycled and I swear that sometimes you can see stuff in the background of the mirror that isn't actually there in real life. So I'm just gonna do a couple back and forths, but I'm curious to see if anyone sees anything that maybe I didn't catch. So here we go. Here's the mirror. Okay, so that's the background. And once again, my apartment. Did you see anything that's out of place? Did you see it? As Kaylin's looking in the mirror, something can be seen sitting on the couch right behind her. But when she turns around, it's gone. Whatever it is, it seems to only be visible in the mirror. Now, whether it's real or just another elaborate TikTok hoax, as always, I leave it up to you to decide. That's not a cow. Nuke's top five viewer Rodriguez sent in a video that he recorded in the woods near his home in Texas. In the video, he explains that he and his cousin have made a quote, base near the woods and he's attempting to show it off on camera. What happens next is truly bizarre. Hey guys, uh, 
I just wanted to show you guys my cool base that I made a while ago with my cousin. Really this nice. quality, Chief? See, we got the entrance all fenced off. Got this thing, I don't know what it is. Well, that stinks. But yeah, we got some chairs. What was that? Is that a cow? What is that? What the oh. hell is that, Chief? <laughs> A weird not. white humanoid figure comes crawling out of the woods and charges towards him on what appears to be freakishly long arms and legs. Hell now, is the video no. real? Is it a hoax? You decide. But this video does have one of the best lines I've ever heard when <laughs> someone encounters something paranormal. Is that a cow? Is that a cow? <laughs> oh, freak! Would you call me? <laughs> it was not a cow. Observe. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, Chief. Some of these videos be kind of disgusting. You me, know, man. you know. Hold on, time out. Like man. that whole LA one. Whew. Which one? There's a girl, the TikToker girl. Oh. That look like a whole mannequin. It, like those are, are like kind of hard because it, it looks so blurred out. Like you can't really see it. Same with this one. This one looked kind of like I don't know. Maybe you found some. Some way to like Photoshop some weird creature yeah. from the movie or something. Like nonchalant. You say, oh. Yeah, look at, look at this guy. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. my, cool, my cool little bass. But you know I'm running, boy. I hear a sound and I'm running. <laughs> I don't want to know if it's a cow or a horse. I don't care. That, I'm alone I, in the I, woods. I, I, I don't need a bass. I'm good at my house. I'm good where I'm at. I am good, bro. These people are too extra, bro. With the whole base, the, the whole haunted house. No, no, no. I'm good. I'm good. I like my life. I'm good, bro. Say I'm a little quiet. Urban. <sighs> Urban Explorer Chris from the YouTube channel Urbex Hills sets out to explore the abandoned Warner and Swayze Observatory cool. in nope. Cleveland, Ohio. Looks cool. Nope. The impressive structure was there. built in the early 1900s and served as an astronomical research facility until it was abandoned in 1982. That looks fine. As always, Chris records his explorations to capture what's left of the historical arc. It reminds me of the marina we got. Have you been to the marina? Yeah. Like all tagged up. Yeah. It looks man. cool. Yeah. A little it's spooky. It's not abandoned and murdered town. It's, it's more like spray painted, uh, juvenile. But you go at night, it's a different world. See, but why would I go at night? <laughs> For what? Because it's cool. Yeah, to you. <laughs> As always, Chris records his explorations to capture what's left of the historical architecture before it's too late. Dang. However, this time that's not all that he captures. Oh, Watch closely scary. as Chris ran. Bro, that alone scared the hell this out of me. This time, that's not all that he captures. <laughs> that scared the hell Watch out of me. Watch closely as Chris randomly films around the outside of the observatory building. Did you see it? Someone or something seems to be watching Chris from the bushes before seemingly disappearing into thin air. Bro, Chris doesn't even notice that. and has no idea what he just recorded. But later, after he posts the video, his viewers point it out in the YouTube comments. So who or what is... <laughs> Yo, am, I, I am, am I blind? <laughs> I, I don't even see this. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how y'all do it, bro. Like... I don't know how people sit through this and, and find stuff. <laughs> it's like a shadow. It's right here, dog. This like figure and it goes like down. In the YouTube he's comments. Close to it, you see? So who or what is this? Look at that. Let me I know, know what how you think. I don't know how you catch that kind of stuff, bro. 
You can watch even more explorations of amazing historic abandoned buildings over on the YouTube channel, Urbex Hill. Like, like he be getting me when he's like, did you see it? <laughs> no, Chief. No, no, no. I, I, I definitely yeah, I like I'm paying. See it. Where's Waldo? He <laughs> literally, literally like, where is it coming from? <laughs> Back to the factory. A while ago, I featured the extremely frightening videos of Ghost Hunter ILMN Bono Paranormal who captured alleged supernatural evidence at an abandoned car parts factory in the city of Ostrava in the Czech Republic. Over 60 years ago, the factory was forced to shut down after a devastating explosion claimed the lives of many of the workers. It is said that the building is extremely haunted by the restless spirits of those workers. After Bono experienced multiple terrifying events at the factory, he had had enough for a while, and he decided just to take a break. But a few months have passed and the explorer is finally ready to return to the creepy old building. And things get weird. Almost immediately after Bono enters the factory, strange things start to happen. Anything changed in here? I just <laughs> I probably stepped in a spider web that freaked the shit out of me. Yeah, I stepped in this. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> that was the scariest thing. Or hey. it maybe it wasn't. I definitely take the eye. I need to oh breathe, Chief. Oh my god. Yeah. Stressing me out, no, bro. No, 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 for sure, bro. Bono is a bit freaked out when he accidentally walks through a spider web. Then he hears a loud bang coming from somewhere in the building and goes to investigate. Take is that? It's smoke. No way. You saw that, right? The explorer sees something out of the corner of his eye. And as he turns, an unexplained cloud of smoke can be seen floating through the air. Bono has no idea what he has just witnessed, but he continues to explore. What happens next is truly bizarre. I didn't upload for like five, six months. And you like really get that video to 1K, even though I didn't upload for half a year. So thank you. And so yeah, I now want to go in uh, yeah, no. in the room with the chair, probably because I want to communicate with them, and I think that room is good for communication. Plus, I have my camera on that. Hello. Did you see it? No, Bono bro, I didn't to his see ears it. And isn't paying attention when in the back of one of the rooms, something seems to quickly hide behind a closet. Bono walks away, but quickly turns back when a loud sound can be heard from the room. He decides to set up two static GoPro cameras and begins to ask questions to the spirits that might be haunting <sighs> the factory. That's when the unexplained activity takes a terrifying turn. Okay, what the f This door is closed. This thing. I don't know if you can see it. Another cup. 
First a glass seems to be thrown at a wall near Bono, then a cup is flung across the room. Now the explorer is starting to freak out from the aggressive paranormal activity, but he holds it together and continues his investigation. He heads to another room inside the abandoned factory and sets up another static GoPro camera. Again, he hears a strange noise coming from somewhere nearby. So, we're in this room. Just so it's almost stand there. Just so it's pointing. Hello? Yeah, I blocked this so it won't fall. I'm scared of this. Hello? I heard sounds from here. I swear. Hello? closet falls over completely on its own, and with that, Bono has finally had enough and decides to just get out of there. So could the factory be haunted by the restless spirits of the workers who tragically lost their lives there? I leave it up to you to decide. You can watch all of Bono's explorations at the Haunted Factory over on his YouTube channel, <laughs> ILMN Bono Paranormal, many moons ago. YouTube and TikTok user Joel Vasquez from San Antonio, Texas claims that late one night... I forget to tell you, uh, since I've watched this, like some of these older ones, um, <clears throat> like for some weird reason, a lot of these like ghost hunters, um, they have like this tradition where you have to curse out whatever it is. <laughs> like the other guy where he was like your mother, and this yeah, and that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you have to... For some reason, they just, it's a thing where you have to curse them out, bro. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Who died, bro. At around 3.40 a.m., he saw something very odd. Bro, y'all missed it. It's like 3.40 in the morning. And I'm seeing a badass eclipse, man. Y'all missed that shit. Ooh, man, it's crazy. I don't even think it's that shit. It might be on that thing. But she's really weird though, because there's like a moon over here. That's why I thought it was weird, but I was like, whatever. There's two of them. So I'm honestly not sure what to think of this video. And Joel's YouTube viewers are divided. Some appreciate the funny commentary, and others believe that Joel has witnessed everything from an alien spaceship to an interdimensional portal. <laughs> Some even claim to have seen the exact same phenomenon in San Antonio and other cities across Texas. So is it real or just a funny and well done hoax? You decide. Ooh, man, it's crazy. Yeah, but I was like, whatever. There's two of them. The secret farm. Whatever, bro. It's like a double rainbow, but instead it's double moon. I think this man was on uh, the trees. I mean, he was chilling. He definitely was chill. The Dutch urban explorer Mark from the YouTube channel Mark Benick I'm is on the road with his friend bro. Luke when they discover a completely abandoned old farmhouse in the countryside of Belgium. Inside the home, the two friends find many old photos and portraits of the previous owners and they discover extensive financial records dating back to the 1970s that have just been left behind. Mark and Luke have no idea why someone abandoned the house and so many personal belongings. After they've explored the property, Mark uploads his recorded footage to his YouTube channel, and some viewers are quick to point out something that Mark and Luke just didn't notice. As the explorers try to find a way through the bushes surrounding the property, Mark records something truly disturbing. Hier gaan we hier gewoon niet binnenkomen, laten we van een andere weg zoeken. We vallen hier natuurlijk ook heel erg op, dus laten we snel gaan. Omdat we wel hier ergens een ingang kunnen vinden. Ik zie hier ook al een kapelletje. En hier is een ingang. Snel gaan we aan de zijkant van dit kapelletje de bosjes in, zodat we volledig uit zicht zijn. En daar moet een heel groot verlaten huis liggen. Did you see it? As Mark and Luke are maneuvering their way through the dense bushes surrounding the property, 
Someone Who's or that? something can be seen peeking out at them from behind a wall. Mark and Luke didn't see anything at the time and only discovered this creepy lurker after the video was uploaded to YouTube. So just who or what is this? You can watch this full adventure and many more urban explorations over on the YouTube channel, Mark Ben Ick. Thanks for watching for extra videos and other stuff. Please check out my Instagram that here, too bad, bro. my Twitter here, and then TikTok. Hopefully, I'll see you next week. TikTok. That wasn't too bad, bro. Did you see it? Yeah, I be I'm, I try, bro. I be trying my hardest, bro. Uh, I mean, I saw that one. That uh, was kind of obvious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, but who's that on the other yeah, side of y'all, like, boys? But my chief, uh, you must be blind not to see that one. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely blind for the other 90% no, of the video. I was like this. <laughs> huh? I'm, and I'm wearing my, my contacts, dog. Yeah, but uh, did, did you see it, though? I know. No, Show dude. me the arrow and rewind it. No, did you see the red button that says subscribe and then the post notification bell to see when you post another video and then the like button that's right there just sitting out nice and pretty for the boys and then the comment section where you can comment down below what video we should react to next. Did you see it though? Alright. Did you see that we're almost at 5k? Uh -huh. It's crazy, right? Uh -huh. Cool. Yo, shout out to Nuke. Always coming in with the top five, top ten. I'm sweating. Oh my god. My dude. my heart rate was at a hundred plus the entire video. Kinda nuts. I got a nice workout in. Uh yeah, bro. I'm pretty good. Two more weeks. Remember to keep it spooky and simple. And we'll see you beautiful people in never the next one. Never simple, bro. Always spooky, never simple. I'm sweating, bro.